Over two dozen people have been killed and many more wounded after severe storms that spawned at least one violent tornado ripped across Mississippi late on Friday, according to the state's emergency management agency on Saturday. It left a trail of damage more than 100 miles long and hundreds without shelter. Though four people earlier reported missing have been located. Piles of twisted metal can be seen here in the western Mississippi town of Rolling Fork, which was hardest hit. Mississippi Governor Tate Reeves on Saturday issued a state of emergency in the affected areas. On Twitter, Reeves said, The scale of the damage and loss is evident everywhere affected today. Homes, businesses, entire communities. President Joe Biden described the images from Mississippi as heartbreaking. He said in a statement that he had spoken with Reeves and offered his condolences as well as full federal support for the recovery. While the White House said Federal Emergency Management Agency Director Deanne Criswell will travel to Mississippi on Sunday to join those already on the ground. At least 24 reports of tornadoes were issued to the National Weather Service on Friday night and into Saturday morning by storm chasers and observers. The reports stretch from the western edge of Mississippi north through the center of the state and into Alabama.